Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve the skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. First, we will understand our question. We will get the number of employees and their ratings as input from the user and we have to form teams that is minimum teams with necessary conditions the conditions are clearly specified that each team can have at most three negative peoples and each team should have at most five peoples we'll take an example where the number of employees is 5 their ratings are minus 5 minus 6 minus 5 2 6 now we have to form teams here we have three negative peoples and two positive people now the possibly occurring team would be the same because it satisfies the condition where at most we have three negative peoples and the utmost people is five peoples. So the answer is one. That is only one team can be formed. Let us consider the next example. Number of employees seven and their ratings are hmm. now the number of negative peoples is one two three that is three and positively rated peoples are four now we will form the possible teams for the first team we will have the three negative numbers in first three places and for the rest we will have two positive peoples as at most we can have five peoples so for the first team the negative will be taken over and we will have two positive people as five minus three is two And we will form the other team using the remaining positive peoples. One team using these positive people. Now we have formed two teams, so the answer is two. Let us consider another example where number of employees is equal to 9 mm. sorry 8 and the ratings are minus 6 5 minus 4 6 yeah these are the ratings now the negative people are 2 and the positively rated peoples will have 6 now we will use this two negative peoples in our first team as it is lesser than or equal to 3 which is satisfying our conditions. One for the first team we will use two negative and we will have three positive people now with remaining positive people we can form our next team here ne negative will become zero and uh, positive will become three that is eight minus five for the second team we'll have three positive people 
So the answer is 2. Now we will implement our program. First we will get our inputs. The number of employees and the ratings of the employees and we will initialize the positive ratings and negative ratings to 0 and 0. Now we will iterate the ratings of the employees and check if rating is greater than 0 then we have to increment positive rating by 1 else we have to increment the negative rating. Now we will initialize the total team equal to 0. At last we are going to print this total team. So now we will use while loop while positive rating greater than 0 or negative rating greater than 0 we will print the total teams incremented by 1 now we will check for our other conditions that is we should have at most 5 members in a team so we use a for loop for counter in range i and if now we are checking for the negative ratings counter lesser than 3 or sorry and negative rating should be greater than 0. Now if this condition satisfies the negative rating will be decremented by 1 else the positive rating will be decremented by 1. At last we are going to print the total teams. Now we will see with an example the number of employees is 7 and their ratings are 5, 6, 2, 4, minus 5, minus 5, minus 4. Now the positive people are 4 and negative people are 3. Now we will pass this to our while loop. 4 is greater than 0 and 3 is greater than 0. The total teams will be incremented by 1 and this for loop will iterate for 5 times and we are going to check if counter is lesser than 3 so when counter is four, 0 the negative rating negative will be 2 and when counter is 1 the negative will be 1 and when counter is 2 the negative would be 0 so now the positive will change sorry when the count and when counter is 3 which will not satisfy our condition so the negative will become 3 so the positive will be 
two, and then it again passes through a while loop. Positive rating greater than equal to zero. Yeah, two is greater than zero, and the total teams will be incremented by one. Then for loop, then it passes through if loop where it doesn't satisfy our condition and come to else, and the positive rating will be decremented by one. So it will become minus three. So now, when positive becomes minus three, the whole while loop will be terminated, and we will print the total teams. This program is very simple if you understand. Thanks for watching. See you in next video.